A basic story about Adam God. We learn from the prophet Lorenzo Snow that as man is, God once was. And as God is, man may become. So what does that mean? Well, there was a man named Michael who lived upon an earth, obtained his exaltation through fulfilling all of the laws, rights, and ordinances of the gospel. He obtained his exaltation and was raised up on high to become like his father before him, a god. Over the eons that passed, Michael and his wife had many, many spirit children. And the time came that his father came to him again and said, Michael, look at this fine family that you have here. It's time to make a world so that your children can have a place to live. Michael and his wife began to form an earth upon which their children could dwell. And when the time came that the world was prepared and built, Michael was told to come down to that earth and to take upon himself the name Adam. So together, Adam and Eve, who were the only ones who had a body in that spiritual world before this world was, came down to make it possible for their spirit children to take upon themselves physical bodies. Once they had finished that work here upon the earth, Joseph Smith teaches us that at a place called Adam on Diamond, Adam, once again, took his place on high and became a god again, so that he could watch over his spirit children on this, on this earth and preside over the whole human family. That, in essence, is the story of the Adam God Doctrine.